Is that fire in the middle of nowhere? That's exactly what's happening, guys. What's up with that? What is up with that? Funny story, back in college, I had a friend whose name was Dat. So, you know, hilarity ensued. He was a cool guy about it, though. Got in here. Another memory. You'd never mistake burning human flesh for ghost and lamb chop. So, um, yeah. I was watching a documentary and they basically said that human flesh smells like pork when it's being cooked. That's pretty disgusting. You know, being a person that likes pork, <laughs> that really scarred me, <laughs> you know. Oh man, there's some documentaries you just shouldn't watch. You can choose to head back over here to get some um, teeth up there. Basically what happens, you have to jump on this thing, use this, uh, this spring right here, and jump over there. I have no reason to go over there because it's just teeth, but I'm just letting you guys know. Ah, oh, come on, come on. I knew that was going to happen. <laughs> it happens at least once. Ah, oh, man. Alright, I might as well show you guys, I suppose. Um, yeah, I'll see if I can. Okay, let's go back up here. Because we can't jump that. Okay. To redeem myself, I will get it for you guys. For that fail that just happened a while ago. And yes, I almost failed again. But that's besides the point. <laughs> Alright, so let's head back down here. Let's just skip that. And then let's head for this totem pole. Easy as pie, guys. Easy as pie. What you saying, kitty cat? Where are you? She who saves a single soul saves the universe. Remember? The universe from the perspective of that person, I guess. Why can't I move? This game does weird things. those wondering, it really wasn't the game. What happened was I pushed mode on the remote. That was easy. Now this guy is difficult. Like, I can't really figure out a perfect way to hit him. Right? You can only parry his attack once. Don't get hit by that. If you go close to him, he does this. Right? And then you gotta get out of the way. Or just hit the umbrella again. If you choose to use this guy, he just defends it. He's very fast. I guess the best way to hit him is after he does that.
Oh, there's a pig over here. I can hear it. I just gotta find it. I can just focus on this right now. Right there. He jumps up in the air, swirling around his samurai um, sword spear thing. You can use the teapot kettle. It's a little hard to find this little pig snout because it's so dark. But there it is. Alright, so we'll just hop over here, grab this little picnic basket. As we can. Let's head back over. There's nothing else in this area, so you don't really have to check. This is the sound of the doors closing behind you. Alright, so they're not very important. Throw this guy here. Jump up here to grab a memory. We'll keep just the one lamp, Alice, as a nightlight. If she stays in the chosen one, I'll save it to the benefactor. It's Alice, the magnificent, the powerful, the brave, the reckless, the rash, the crazy, the imprudent. Yes, you really must. He knows things. He even thinks things. So there's a pig snout somewhere here. I'm not sure if I found it last time. Oh yeah, it's playing. Yeah. Alright, so we got that. Let's get some energy back. And then we'll continue hunting for some mosquitoes. Where are you, Alice? Where are you at? Oh. That's enough healing. Now there's a puzzle somewhere up here. It's pretty easy. Nothing to worry about. It's very similar to the one that we saw while we were under the sea. This one you can do in about three moves. Your victories in combat and conundrum suggest your fitness to confront the challenges ahead. Mental strength will confirm your worthiness, or declare your defeat. Actually, about six moves. Alright, so first we've got to find the other puzzle pieces. You can find two over there, I believe. You can find one up there, and one there. So first, we'll just head up here. Now, there's a guy who attacks you. Um, yeah, he t attacks you right here, so be careful. I tell you to be careful when I get hit, guys. That's how we do it. I do it for poops and giggles. Just to make you guys laugh. Alright, so you just toss your little bomb here. And you gotta jump up on top of this thing here. I'm sure you saw the cube a while ago. Come on. I'm trying to think this game is rigged. That's exactly what happened to me the first time. Alright, so we got that. Let's just head over here. Grab the one over here.
Alright, there's one more on this side, as you can see. One right here. It is over here. Behind this honeycomb thing. Let's go. Alrighty then, so we can move the head down one and move this guy, come on, this guy over, this up, this across, this up, and this across. So about six minutes, I didn't count. Let's go, 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 go. Alright, so where can we go now? I'm gonna walk across this thing. I'm not going to bother getting these teeth. I don't see a point. The wicked wasps lay siege upon us and control the peaks to east and west. You must defeat them to reach Caterpillar's retreat. I suppose I must go to the mountain top, as it won't come to me. We have faith that Caterpillar, the strange and wondrous, helps those in need. One day we'll have proof. Purity of heart is to will one thing. To approach his sacred eyrie, you must confront the savage Daimyos. You will prevent our access to his power. I'll open the entrance to the sacred caves where your journey begins. So this area that you enter inside the painting, Looks a lot like a combination of like Super Mario, Paper Mario, and Okami. It looks pretty cool. It's kind of a boring side quest kind of thing, but you basically have to. Oops. You basically have to climb the entire mountain, right? You can see the path that we have to take. So let's go ahead and do that. Not wasting any of your time, guys. I may babble on like a fool, but I play like a pro sometimes. Regard this depiction right. of domestic harmony and order. The fruitful landscape encouraged industry, tolerance, and cooperation. Loving families flourished, happy children, dear friends, grateful for their well-being, lived for generations, secure, active, free. But a sudden onslaught of alien attacks broke their fragile bodies and nearly crushed their generous spirits. Now this area is a little tricky, you gotta wait for a bit for this to fall, right there. This one just walk off, don't try 